Vice Chancellor of the Academic, the Deputy Vice Chancellor of the Government, the Registrar, the Bursa, the University of Nigeria, the Tanya Vice Chancellor of the Spiritual University, the Vice Chancellor of the Spiritual University. The Armenia Registrar of this university in the person of Omar Barmesi, Kepele John. Members of staff of the College of Food Science and Ecology of the University of Nagra Rachel of the Day Belongs. These are directors and especially let me also welcome the Nobel Lecturer himself, the Dean of the College of Science and Human Ecology. <laughs> Directors of Institutes, the United Teaching Institute Centers and Services, the Head of the Department of Food Science and Technology to which the Nobel Lecturer belong, heads of other departments and units, Representative of the state government, directors of national centers, many that are present here today, members of the Sony family, invited guests, members of the university community, gentlemen of the press, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, and great. Permit me at this time to invite the good of here the number that you want to give for a good time. Today, Thursday, the first May 2015, was 
assistant lecturer under my leadership as a coordinator of the Department of Business and Technology.
the agreement on the expert board of the International Journal of Science and Technology since 2008, and this is a review to many international and data-based journals. Professor Sonny has examined undergraduate and postgraduate students in full science and technology for a couple of various degrees at many universities in this country, including Ibadan, Akure, Lagos, among others. Ladies and gentlemen, starting with me today is the immediate past president of the Nigerian Institute of Full Science and Technology. Thank you. 
invite my colleague. Followed by my institutional honor, 
Professor Mrs. S. D. A. Usochu. And the last before my own was actually presented by the dynamic and elder professor, Professor Mrs. Monake Ishu. The God be the glory. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Vice Chancellor, challenges we all face is poverty, hunger, malnutrition of large populations. In recent years, there have been quite a lot of discussions on topics like coastal farming, the case study of Oboma Shomando is there, tomato in the north is there as case studies. Quite a lot of discussions of losses. Everybody keep on talking of how do we make our products to be stable, quality problem, and of recent economic value. We have a duty to ensure safe and abundant food for all. In order to ensure wealth creation and stable life and see the people, community and corporate entity called the and I mean myself to the wisdom and knowledge of Prophet Yusuf and Esmat was that who after his confess of the dream that is definitely going to rule the world and was incarcerated and later it was released and again asked him what do you want me to do for you? And he said, and I quote, place me in authority over the treasures of the land. Surely, I am a good keeper doing well. Quran chapter 12, verse 55. Prophet Yusuf showed his words of preservation as I am trying to do today. I pray that the Nigerian government will get the wisdom of this message. <laughs> Mr. Master, sir, distinguished audience, please permit me to present. My output emanated for over two decades of dry research in today's 49th program of global energy, the fifth for my department and the third for my college, titled Dry for Wet, Food Security and National Building. Between 
we advance the research into refined travel of yam slices. Yam actually optimized yam slices. Just like we are trying to prepare what we have to prepare potato fry. And we got very good results. Number one, dry had a significant effect on oil and moisture content, including the breaking force. And we got optimum the dry condition of temperature of 70 to 75 degrees for about 3 to 4 minutes, while frying for 4 to 5 minutes. So we, we moved away from jam slices and we also moved into another living vegetables. And this was actually conducted by Shitu et al. with supervision of Professor Murena and myself. We look at the effect of sun, solar, and both plant on two Nigerian living vegetables. And we observe that the most severe plant conditions that you have with when you have higher temperature and force there, that is for the oven dry samples. You have that. But there was no significant difference in the sliminess of the dry vegetable, and which was very good for us. And sun dry was not a good product using this method. We also look at artfish and jam. Sunny and Magella in 1999. This is where we actually look at the effect of dry methods on the chemical refrigeration system. We also look into normal storage method of the dried samples. And we have very minimal moisture content after drying, and we also could be content from the tomato that we have tried. In terms of acceptability, we have a majority of the consumers still prefer freshly prepared tomato. But the point is, the Nigerian industry is increasing in millions every year. If any Nigerian see dried tomato, Outside of the they will be cautious, just as most of us are doing when we travel abroad. Mr. Vice Chancellor, what I tried to do was to show you the attempt that we have done using God's natural resources, that is known as energy source for drying. Attempting to also create the house, either in small to be able to dry, called solar dry. I'm now going to move into the second realm of my research, which is beyond a very big productive experience, and I'm start with Fufu. The Fufu, many of us here do not want to eat Fufu because of its offensive odor. Signing a job in 2000 in Tenefuel was able to observe that the major component responsible for the offensive odor in the country was actually with annoying acid. And the partners in the UK were understanding how best can we improve how we deal with annoying acid. And what we did Thank you. 
now everybody wants to go to UI because we find out that our research can also be competitive with our colleagues in Europe. Very well, for some things. There are quite a lot of activities that are going on. The driving permeable life brand scheme. We actually attempt to hinder the movement of the moisture away from Fufu. And I will tell you what we have done to remove that. Two, there was some form of case at that also turning turning dry. We saw those two problems. I will soon see them. Number one, we were able to after dry and optimization to reduce the butanoic acid in white from 46 to barely less than 0.12 microgram per gram of the dry matter of our dry in the United Kingdom. And immediately, the Bodens meet. This was 1991 professor of instant Started another research entirely. 
and the result was the output of Fanny and Tom 2006. When we look at the quality of flash and rotary drive of Fufu, and this was where we observed that there were some kind of significant tip differences in the two dry metals. And you cannot believe it that dry food using a rotary dryer was more acceptable to the consumers than flash dryer. If I have an opportunity to do this experiment, I will tell you why. As at that time, little did we knew then that the water is also a principal factor for you to get effective drying system. I think my engineer is remembering that. Because if you can do water very well, you spend little energy to dry. Two, because once you dry with a hotel, it becomes easier for you to gelatinize more and form that firmness in dry than flash dry. That thing will solve that with the IITA and other projects. But again, we were still looking for how do we solve the stickiness in the Because if you want to use flash drive, you will still solve the stickiness. And we now look into the effect of addition of power and certain elements. Certain elements are like citric acid or sodium hydroxide. You remember what we were trying to do? We were trying to play with the white, the oil, to be able to see how you make the complex. And all the standardization of the static colors. And we got very good results. And we move again using glycerol from the target and monoglycerol for it. We'll be able to also improve on this. This was available at the end of 2005. When we look at the result of this, number one, addition of hybrid glycerol from the static. Thank you. 
was on our farm. And when we pay this instrument that is being sponsored by the region to actually optimize this solar house, and that's why it's quite a lot of ventilation blocks in the solar house. And we are getting it. We look at Kasama being as energy source. We look at salt as energy source. We also look at Kashu Shell Pond as energy source. And at the end of the day, the site is still well. But I think uh, we, we are getting very good results from that. Now, I want to take you straight to try for weight. I passed through the Master of Technology 
and later the University of Lagos, and later the University of Agriculture. Now, some of you who want to watch something in engineering, we did everything as the first foundation student of this university. And this actually has cost cities higher than award under the Labour Leadership of IIT when we actually put in for this contest. We were only 10 in the world that were given an award in 2008. <laughs> Mr. Master says, there have been quite a lot of awards to my most thank you for giving me two awards for second year. I must thank all other institutions that are finding me more of getting awards. Actually, I want to thank the Foundation Vice Chancellor. Because he started this award in 1988, and we were only three students that were giving award. I remember my teacher then, Mr. Fry, won the Productivity Award in 1988. Thank you very much. Quite a lot of global travelers moving in and out of the globe, representing your university. I must thank everyone of you. To African women in agricultural research and development, I think I'm the only mentor that was given the opportunity to mentor six big intellectuals, women in Africa, and they are actually making waves. Thank you very much. My recommendation. Number one, like I said, there have been quite a lot of problems with the system over 153 SMEs. The one government claimed they are helping and not up to that as I'm talking to you. Too bad of you, I want to open it to Sakuru Damage. All these private sectors have invested nothing less than 20 million per one SME. But most of those companies have been closed down for well over six years. What kind of transformation are we doing? We have reached the same by times as the series of things that we don't need to. And that's why I said, I pray the federal government of Nigeria to understand the wisdom of what we are saying. Two, we need to continue to invest in the improvement of agricultural technology in Africa. I think it is high time we have a separate ministry of post harvest or we allow the office of the special assistant of the president of food security to be active once again as was done by the president of Boston. That was the best mechanism that advances all this technology I'm showing to you today. Also, we need to harmonize quite a lot of agricultural based projects. I think we have to be getting ourselves. We know ourselves. Mr. Pastor, appropriate plan is a tool of changing and developing the regional economy. Leadership is definitely the pay of our establishment. I've been privileged to be part of the technical of the presidential initiative of Kassel, while I was a postnatal scientist in IT, and also for the Kassel Transformation as a country manager of Kassel Transformation. I must say that there seems to be a serious disconnect between the two initiatives. We need to sustain our collective reason to solve our individual problems. The minister cannot come today, dismantle all good things, and start another one. Another minister will come, dismantle, and start another one. Nigeria will not move. We will continue that one. Private 
has relented. To God be the glory, I want to acknowledge and thank and ask Mahana Watala for sparing my life and giving me the strength. I must especially thank Professor Kutuasi. This inaugural lecture of today was put during the presidential election of April, April 12th. And we are having the program today. I must thank my past president, we did not discuss, but I was approving as the Patelli. Thank you for the confidence in the country. For my parents, my father and my mother, I pray that God to forgive you and bless all your options. To my immediate uncles, my immediate brother who just came to last year, and my uncles, I pray that God to forgive all of you. To my uncle that is alive. I want to thank you. May Allah bless you and bless everything you do and guide you and make you happy. I want to also thank my father, Papa Shim Sunni, sitting here, and our Baloko in the Lego. We do respect Baloko and Lilu Sunni. I want to thank our first senior sister, Khadija Sunny. I thank you. My mother has seen Sia, the junior sister, and this call for all of me. I thank you. To my teachers and mentors, the Municipal Family School. Baptist Grammar School should be here. I thank you for Baptist Grammar School. I thank you for the student. That was my uniform when I was here. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.